I want um, us to answer a question. I'll give you a scenario and then you tell us what the lady has to do. There was an engaged couple. This you know. Now they were engaged. Then the lady walked out of the relationship because she met a rich man and decided to leave her fiancé. The guy, through a lot of pain, moved on. After a while, the lady found out that this rich man was a fraudster. She wants to repent. Do we understand? So what must she do? Yes. You know, I, I wanted to say that she should have returned the car, back out of the flat. Because that's the, that's, that's the only way you can show true repentance. Because you cannot be driving the car and be saying you have repented. Yes. Back out of the flat, return the car. If possible, return the clothes. Yes. How about the yes. money? Yes. The money. Yes. The money you have not eaten, return it. Who is saying yes? Who is saying no? Let's hear from the nose. What I'm saying is that I will not return it if I'm in that um, picture. My time. Why? Let, she has a point. Let, let, yes, My why? time. Uh, yes, I made a mistake. I agree. I was, um, I scammed myself. I won't say I was scammed. You know, so but my time, everything that I've put into that relationship and everything, I have to walk away with something. Then, praise the Lord. You must walk away with something. something. So let's not. I know that we are all righteous people here, but let's put our human parts, um, human feelings. Can she? Can she please speak? Can she speak, please? I know. Like I said, I know we are all righteous people, and. Um, but at the same time, we are humans. So you ask yourself, okay, fine, I know I've made a mistake and there's no future in this thing, but how, do, okay, I'm going to, at first I've apologized to the guy, I, maybe I disappointed and everything. But, you are not there yet, though. Okay, I'm not, okay, we uh -huh. are not going to that. Okay, fine, if I'm to walk away from that relationship, I'll walk away, yes, with myself and everything, but whatever I got in that relationship is going with me. I can't waste my time for nothing. Are you saying you have invested time? I have invested my time, myself, everything. Everything. And you have lost your reputation? Somehow. Yes. I can't walk away empty-handed. And you don't even know what the future holds. And I don't know what the future holds, too. So it's more like an insurance for myself. He can't demand for it. He can't. But can you ever have true repentance if you are still driving that car? Yes. And still wearing the jewelry? Have you forsaken? Or you just stepped aside? Okay, okay, okay. To pass, even at that, uh, if I'm going to go with true repentance, I'll go with those things then. Even if I don't want to see them, I'll sell them off. If I don't want to see the jewelry anymore, I don't want to see the car he gave to me, but more like, like I said, the insurance I'm doing for myself, I'll sell those things off and use the money and buy something else. If I don't want to see okay, those things... Okay, well, I think this is... There should be a conversation around this. So, those of you, is it safe for you to tweet and all that and have a conversation as to what you should really do? Those that believe that true repentance, you must leave it. And those that believe that because you, are, you say you have invested, that either you walk away with it because you've lost time and all that, and then we'll now look at restitution and the word forsake. Can we generate some conversations here? Do, do you think the online people, is Shola around, do you think it's something that can generate some, some conversation eh, and maybe can invest? bring some people to church when they know that uh, we're trying to resolve issues like this. 